beauties welcome back what's going on i know i said that my next video was going to be my horror t-shirt collection but i pretty much stopped filming that because i was really indecisive on what i wanted to do whether i just wanted to sit down and show you guys individually my shirts and kind of give you like a little backstory to each of them some of them don't have backstories because some of them are new or if I wanted to like insert clips of me wearing them individually. I did put a poll up on my uh, YouTube uh, community tab. So please help a sister out. Go there um, and go ahead and decide for me. Because I have no idea what you guys, how you guys want me to do this video. And I'm pretty indecisive. So please help your sister out. I would so appreciate it. This is your first time here. Go ahead and subscribe. We're going to have a lot of fun this month on this channel for Halloween. But today I am going to be talking about Bath and Body Works stuff and Goose Creek. You guys, I am like seriously getting obsessed with Goose Creek. And we all know that I love Bath and Body Works here. So <laughs> let's get into it. I'll show you the things that I got at Bath and Body Works maybe like a week or two ago. I didn't go crazy. I legit only spent like $29. I had a coupon for a free hand cream, which I will show. And they had a $5.95 sale on the Body Mist. And I just kind of wanted to go check out the new stuff that came out, like the fall fragrances, things of that nature. And I also just bought one three-way candle because I'm trying to burn through some of my stuff. I know that was a mouthful. Let's get into it. The hand cream that I got for free with my coupon, I chose Sweet Whiskey. I absolutely fell in love with this, you guys, when I smelled it, which was completely surprising to me because this is this has more of like a masculine type of hint to it. If that is your thing, you would love this. I usually go for like bakery scents, sweet fruity scents, sometimes floral scents, depending on how they mix it in with some specific notes that I like, like bergamot and amber and, and things of that nature. But I have to say, you guys, I even looked for this in a body mist and they were sold out. Sweet whiskey. I have it on my hands right now and it's just super cozy it like i said it has that hint of masculinity to it and i really really love it because it's sort of reminding me of like marshmallow fireside like just in my opinion and how my scents are picking it up but it's it and it's got that sweetness to it as well like i absolutely love this so i picked it up in the hand cream and then the only body mist that i picked up because everything else was just like eh, i wasn't too you know like overwhelmed by things that they had i wasn't like oh my gosh i had to have them but these two yes they were amazing they smell absolutely delicious and perfect for the fall season so the first one that i picked up was sun rise woods and this has notes of creamy sandalwood sweet berries and koji cashmere and this is absolutely stunning you guys i love the packaging on this it's just very warm and cozy as well i really get that berry scent but i really really like this you guys and it's you know i'm really not too keen on like the sandalwood notes but this one got my heart so I grabbed that and then the other one that I really, really fell in love with and especially the packaging, Super Fall, it has leaves all over the packaging. But this is one of their newest scents for the fall season. It's called Golden Clementine and Amber and it has notes of juicy citrus, sparkling pomegranate and warm amber. You guys, this is absolutely stunning. Like if they bought this out in a perfume, I would totally buy it. Like I highly recommend this if you like cozy um let me spray it like on my clothes because i have that lotion on my hands and i don't want to like mix the two and then not know what the hell i'm like describing to you guys like the citrus and the pomegranate just mix so well together in this one is absolutely stunning i love 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 it it's not strong it's super it's not super sweet it's like right in the middle it's reminding me of a perfume that i cannot put my tongue on right now that i've had before that has like the citrus notes to them but this is absolutely stunning i love this if there was one body mist that i would recommend for the fall season it is this one it is the golden clementine and amber because it is just so juicy so good i freaking love this so I got those two and the hand cream. And then the other thing that I got from Bath and Body Works was 
fall festival, I legit was in line just with the three items and, and the checkout lane. The three wood candles were also on sale when the body mist sale was going on. And I saw this one and I read the notes before I smelled it. And the notes are fresh pumpkin, spiced cinnamon, and sweet maple almond butter. I don't think I've ever bought a three wood candle from Bath and Body Works that has almond, a note of Ma sweet maple almond butter in it excuse me and i like smell this and i was like purchase this reminds me of just going to a fall festival like the the pumpkins mixed with like the fresh apples in the air the fall leaves like this also screams like funnel cake to me to me it smells like a little bit of funnel cake but it's not like oh my gosh funnel cake is just reminding me of funnel cake because this just reminds me of like exactly what it's called a fall festival so it's absolutely yummy it's another bakery sweet notes if you're into that kind of thing i really recommend this one there's another one that they came out with called um i think it's like sweet kettle corn or something like that and they did not have it in stock yet at my uh current location so I was kind of sad because I really, really wanted to smell that one because me personally, I love kettle corn. But after my two, like my major two surgery that I had a few years back, if you've been with me for that long, maybe I've mentioned it in the past before, you know what I'm talking about. I stopped eating popcorn because of the major uh, two surgery that I had. Um, and just like my teeth are really sensitive now, so I'm kind of careful with what um, I eat. I don't even chew gum either. Like I stopped doing that too. But I really, really want to try to get my hands on that sweet kettle corn. If you've gotten your hands on it, please let me know how it smells. Try to describe it as much as you can. Hit me up on Instagram, TikTok, whatever. Just let me know because I want to know you guys until I can get my hands on that one. So that is um, the items that I got at Bath and Body Works. So let's get into Goose Creek. So as soon as I did my first Goose Creek video, you guys like gave me so much feedback you guys were for it i know a lot of people don't like bath and body works um candles so they opt out for other stuff and that's completely fine everyone you know has their own preferences i will say though me being a huge bath and body works candle lover goose creek is legit like right there next to bath and body works like if you don't like bath and body works i highly recommend you guys try out goose creek candles because they certainly are not for the faint of heart when it comes to their notes and how like the throw on the candles are you guys like some of these candles are super strong i'm gonna be completely honest with you with the next three that i bought because after my first video i ended up purchasing again a couple of more candles that were on sale for like 10.99 another great thing about goose creek is that they always have sales on their candles i think they're actually um having one right now i'm filming this on a friday it's my early day and i want to put this out on friday so again um my t-shirt halloween collection you guys i want to put that one out next but please help me go to my youtube community uh post and please help your girl out and choose which one you want me to do for that video so i can at least post it by uh, Monday night so Goose Creek I purchased three more candles the first one was candy bag I legit purchased this candle because of the packaging it is absolutely gorgeous and it has my favorite color on it I'll put the notes on the bottom for you so you know um, what they are but this is also from the Halloween collectors edition of this year this is called candy bag and I'm gonna I'm gonna legit be honest with you I like this cold when I burn this it is really really strong and it first burns like a chocolate note and then it goes into like you can smell regular candy like maybe some sweet tarts or what's the other one that are they're cut kind of smarties stuff like that like it's just a mix like it just smells like a real candy bag when you open it and you can smell the chocolate you can smell the different types of candies in it this has such a far throw you guys like if you have this candle or if you're thinking of picking up this candle i highly recommend not to burn these candles in a small room just because the smell and the throw of these candles are so intense like it was legit bothering my nose that's how strong they are not strong to where it gives you a headache because so far none of the goose creek candles that i've purchased 
have given me a headache but this you guys has such a strong throat it's ridiculous like I think I'm gonna burn some of these throughout the house just so I can burn through them because I don't want to burn these in my room just because it was really bothering my nose this one I like halfway like 50% I'm like eh, 50% I like it just because of the candy note but I didn't like when it first started burning and it smelled like just chocolate like that was just too much for me so but yeah this is uh the first one that i bought and either way it's gonna get used i'll just burn it out throughout the house so yeah and another thing i love about goose creek candles you guys they burn so freaking clean like not one candle that, that i've gotten from goose creek has burned and has like left nasty residue in the wax like they've all burned super clean second one that i picked up it was on sale for 7.99 because i think this was a limited edition and they're not bringing these back but it is a lucky marshmallows you know just like lucky charms type of thing the packaging is cute again very very strong you guys i do not like burning this one in my room i'm gonna be honest with you I really don't like this one like it burns exactly the way cereal smells but then you get the hint of milk like if the cereal is in the milk and obviously you can see the cereal on the packaging in the milk as well but I just don't like that note of milk like I'm not vibing with that if they still have the, this one on the site and you were thinking about this, getting this one I'm I'm not a fan you guys I'm gonna be straight up with you I'll burn it to get through it obviously because I purchased it and I'm just not gonna like throw it out or whatever but yeah I'm not a fan of this one so this one is a big no-no like even if they bought it out again I wouldn't purchase this one again and then the last one that I got I absolutely love the packaging is so on point it's another Halloween candle from their collection of this year and this one is midnight berry and it is super nice super fruity a little less strong than the other two but a clean burn absolutely super fruity I really like this one this is my number one out of all three that I purchased on the second go around but sorry guys I'm like I've been having like something in my eye for the past hour and I feel like I get it out and then it's just like it's still there it's just so freaking annoying and sorry that I still haven't worn like I know I'm going off topic but I miss talking to you guys I haven't worn makeup in almost like two months now and I really really want to like my heart is getting back into wanting to do makeup I just came home I wanted to do my makeup but that was probably gonna take like an hour and I was just like you know what let me just change freshen up you know I got this hat at Walmart by the way <laughs> I love the color and I loved what it said because I'm I'm vibing with this yes but like I'm you see I'm everywhere but <laughs> Walmart <laughs> yeah I just came home was just like I don't have time to do makeup right now and I really really wanted to share this stuff with you guys so I could like burn through my candles now usually when I want to share stuff with you guys I don't use it until I share it with you guys because I have a habit of just like putting everything away and just being super organized and stuff but if you want to get Goose Creek candles Halloween candles are probably still on sale I really recommend Midnight Berry and then I really recommend for my first one the candy corn cake pop that one is extravagant it's so delicious I absolutely love that one and I am currently burning a um, pumpkin spiced latte that my cousin bought me and I'm actually liking it Midnight Berry number one out of the three I absolutely love it so I really really recommend this one and I really really recommend the candy corn cake pop if you are wondering about Goose Creek you guys again not for the faint of hearts because their candles are actually freaking very strong very well made very clean and I absolutely love them so it's like when I can't get my hands on some candles at Bath and Body Works because they're not on sale I definitely just go to Goose Creek now so there's like you know that's like my backup candle company you guys oh and for the first time I'm gonna try their moisturizing shower gel yep live on camera there goes my earring I would have been really really sad and upset if that happened outside and I didn't notice because these these earrings were a, a gift from my cousin-in-law when we went to Greece 
But yeah, I got watermelon lemonade in their moisturizing shower gel. It was on sale for $3.99 and I am almost done with my moisturizing shower gels from Bath & Body Works. So I was like, it's on sale. Let me try it. See how their body stuff is. So if you didn't know, they also sell body stuff there and hand soap as well, you guys. So $3.99, this was the other thing that I almost forgot to share that I picked up. So four and four. Four items from Goose Creek, four items from Bath & Body Works. Again, you guys, please give this video a thumbs up if you found it helpful. Background, amazing, right? My lights are on, but you can't see them because of my ring light. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you guys are doing well. Let me know in the comments down below. What are you thinking about these products? What are you shopping for the fall season? I want to know. And what are you guys up to this month for Halloween? Um, unfortunately, we're not going to Halloween Horror Nights. We had wanted to go, but some, you know, family stuff like is going on and you know, my family comes first. So I just want everyone to be fine, but we're not going. So I'm looking for some things to do in my area. Like I saw this huge billboard post for like Hale House like hell house haunted type of thing and i'm trying to find it online and i can't find the address to it because i would really really like to go to at least to a haunted house this year so since you know we lost halloween last year <laughs> but i hope you guys are doing well again leave me comments down below on anything you guys anything halloween anything october what are you guys up to i hope you guys are doing well okay <laughs> And again, please help me out on my community tab in YouTube so I can do my horror t-shirt uh, collection for you guys next. And I just purchased a couple of more from Torrid because I had a lot of like hope cash that I did not know that I had and they almost expired and I wanted to use some of them. So I got some stuff from there that comes in. I'll share that with that with you. So I haven't done a Torrid haul in a minute, so I'll probably post one up this month. For you guys but i love you guys please be safe please be kind to one another and please be kind to yourself i hope you guys are having a good october so far i love you guys and i will see you in a couple of days bye